has OD'd on Octane. And Chuckleheads busting knuckles on homemade turnbuckles. If you like watching other people watch their lives pass before their eyes, this is your near-death experience party headquarters. It's Whacked Out Sports, the most insane sports blooper show ever. My adrenaline is pumping. Every year, just as summer is hitting its peak and folks are feeling frisky, a giant wave of buzzkill sweeps the nation in the form of anti-fireworks activism, which manages to keep America's guys safe for about 30 seconds. Then this happens. If our founding fathers were alive today, you know Patrick Henry would be firing a Roman candle at Nathan Hale's butt. Right now, I am on my knees in the booth with my palms pressed together, and I beg you, do not try this at home. <laughs> or on the backyard deck. Under your sleeping cousin's legs is no place for a lit sparkle fountain. Also, don't throw quarter sticks of dynamite into decorative ponds if you can help it. You don't want this to happen to you, right? Good. Glad we're all on the same page. All right, who tampered with the sign? Living on the coast, you can really start taking tasty waves for granted. But what about places where there are no waves? Places like Newcastle, England. These British backyard bozos spend their gray summer days car surfing. That's Alistair King on top of the 75 Datsun B210 being driven by his best mate, Gaz. Don't get fooled by the fancy accents. The vast majority of British people are out of their damn minds. We'll let Alistair explain. Right. It's a giggle, isn't it? With nothing to do, so nods as good as a wink, up now. Tuppence for the guy. Pip, pip, cheerio. Please, sir, may I have some more? And all that lot. What? Can't argue with that, mostly because I have no idea what the hell he's talking about. Still, this beats sitting through a Judy Dench movie any day. Let's shoot over to Death Wish Peak in Colorado, America's backyard, where they just had the storm of the century. Oh yeah, that's eight feet of ski-dazzling fresh powder, my friends. And you know what that means. Cut school and add another item to your nut job resume. That's exactly what Brody Tompkins, his best bud Bud, and his best bud Bud's best...